Oh no, did he throw it off? Ah. Alright guys, so I'm out here again today uh, doing some sun fishing. It's my first fish today. Hopefully they get a lot bigger. But he's got some pretty color to him. Let's go home today. I would keep him, but first fish, y'all. Let's get him back in the water. So what I'm doing, I'm kind of, I'm throwing a drop shot rig out there with this uh, lure right here, this plastic bait. Kind of got it rigged like this, and I probably got that about, I don't know, that's probably about maybe a foot from the bottom, and we're just kind of throw it against the bank and working our way back. So far, I haven't got many bites up near the bank. I've been getting more bites when I get it like to a like to a little drop off. And then it hits the bottom. That's when I'm getting most of my bite. That's the first. That's actually the second fish, and all and all honestly, that I caught. The first one I was trying to get my camera on, and he popped off while that was happening. So that's my so that's my first fish on camera. But we're gonna go up and down. Just go up this bank right here and kind of work it and. See what we can get. I'm gonna set my drop shot rig real quick. That is broke off. And what I got here is uh, this is four pound braided line, but it's a diameter of two pound line. So I'm fishing really, really light and thin, trying to get as much because the less the fish can see, the better off your chances are catching them. So I got it's a little light wire eagle claw hook here, size uh, eight. So you can see very small. What I'm gonna do is, sorry guys. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna tie a polymer knot into it. I'm gonna put this up probably about a foot and a half or so off the bottom. Then, with the drop shot rig, it's very important take this end way down here, the tag end at the very, very bottom of your line, and stick it through the eye of the hook with your hook facing up. And you pull it all the way through, so that helps make your hook stand like this. Otherwise, your hook might end up being like some weird way. That's not very very good for fishing. And then I have myself a little, oop, like a little little sinker. I forget what size this is. I, I think it's like a like an eighth of an ounce or something like that. It's pretty small. There. Just like that. We got ourselves a knot. We got ourselves the uh, the polymer. The polymer. Drop shot rig right there. And it actually has actually way more than a foot and a half, but we'll make it roll. And the bait I'm using, I just found these online. This is made by Northland Tackle. These little impulse baits here. And I've been using this white kind, these white little blood worms. I also got green pumpkin and I got some little little minnows and stuff that I'm gonna use on later on in the year. But for now, we're gonna keep using these. I mean look how cool this thing looks. Look how much it wiggles. Yeah, it's deadly underwater, so let's get back up there. I need some more fishing.
Hey everyone, I'm sorry for the long absence. I, I'm finally back making videos again. Um, that video you just saw was me fishing way back in, in uh, like early, early October. So, I'm sorry I've been gone so long and haven't been, been posting. Uh, I just, uh, and honestly, I kind of just got uh, burned out from fishing for a second there, I think. I just need to take a break and just, uh, just to do some other things, but I'm back now. I'm back out fishing. It feels good to be back out there, y'all. So I'm happy, happy to be back. And what I was doing in that video mostly, I was uh, targeting a uh, wooden structure along the bank. Um, in that particular area, the, it ranged from five foot deep all the way down to twenty foot. Um, so that's what I was catching. No, no big gills. I did catch one decent one towards the end, but they weren't bad at all. And the bait itself, the impulse bait. They're really good bait. I like it a lot. Um, I'm going to use it, be using it a lot this winter. I'm going to use a lot more drop shot rigs and stuff around some fallen timber stuff during this winter. So I will sure be using it again and showcasing it. And, but once again, I'm not sponsored by them. I just, I just like the bait. So uh, thank you all so much for watching my video. Thank you so much for sticking around and waiting for me to come back. And if you are new to the channel, please do subscribe. I do. I would surely and greatly appreciate it. And other than that, y'all, thank y'all so much, and see you next video.